big scary movie. Today we're gonna dig through the ditches and burn through the witches. Why? Because I have the Rob Zombie tribute box from Zobi. That's Zobi, Z O B I E, not zombie, Zobi. Without further ado, I'm gonna open up this bad boy and check out the Rob Zombie stuff inside. So, as I'm opening this crate, this is Zero, your host. And welcome to the channel if you're new. If you're returning, thanks for coming back. I'm going to be opening this box, going through this mystery box of Rob Zombie items from Zobi. And if you do enjoy mystery box unboxing videos, feel free to give this video a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button for more mystery box unboxing videos. I do a lot of mystery box unboxing videos. I also do video game content and movie reviews. So feel free to check that out as well. Without further ado, I'm going to open this box up. And I see this... this it's paper so i'm gonna get rid of that just paper and i see a note and i don't like notes because it says dear fellow fright freaks i might have had too much to drink topo chico to drink because i included a spicy photo in this release but i had fun with it i hope you enjoy so actually it's a it's a good note and actually a cheat sheet on the back so I am looking forward to what we got. I'm going to put the cheat sheet over here for now. And now we begin our Rob Zombie tribute. And I'm going to start with our pin. This pin is absolutely awesome. For those of you who don't know, Rob Zombie's The Munsters just came out on Netflix not too long ago. And we have a Munsters pin. We have Grandpa Munster reading a newspaper. I am not dead. Fantastic start to the crate. I love the Munsters. I actually did a movie review on the Munsters. So go check that out if you're interested in seeing that movie. But a good start to the crate. I really like this pin. This pin is absolutely awesome. I'll put that off to the side for a second. And now we have our t-shirt. Let's take a look at what t-shirt we got. All right, so it looks like we have a Halloween t-shirt. Nice. So I am a huge Halloween fan. It's one of my favorite franchises. I did enjoy Rob Zombie's Halloweens. I know that that's kind of controversial. Some people love it. Some people hate it. I enjoyed it. I don't want to say I loved it, but I did enjoy both of the movies. So a really cool t-shirt. Let's try and read some of what's on here deceive you his eyes will look brother if you're looking for some kind of action big joe grizzly they will take from you your innocence these eyes do not see what you and i see behind these eyes one finds only blackness the absence of light these are the eyes of a psychopath. So really awesome shirt, especially for the Halloween Michael Myers fans. I'm loving this shirt, great shirt for the box. Now let's take a look at our next item and we have what looks to be an autograph. And <laughs> y'all are gonna, holy fuck. Look at this one. I'm gonna have to rate this fucking PG because of this. <laughs> Because of this photo so this is a ginger lynn autograph and you're gonna see the different options we could have gotten this is actually kind of funny i like the clown in the background i remember this scene captain spaulding right there so ginger lynn autograph and i will show you the different options and there is a jsa authentication on the back of this so nice autograph pretty funny actually i will show you all of the variants that i could have gotten in a little bit so now let's take a look at the next couple of ones that i got so i got here we got something in here let's take a look i gotta open this up hold on hold on for a sec 
I may need my knife. Where'd my knife go? Take a look. Try not to cut myself or the picture. All right, there we go. All right, we're rolling, we're rolling. Almost there. Apologize for the technical difficulties that I am experiencing. But I want to make sure that I don't cut this. All right, here we go. So there was a piece of cardboard that I don't need. And y'all are going to like this. This is a nice big picture. Has the JSA on the back. And we have Richard Brake. So he is in a lot of different Rob Zombie movies. I'm actually looking at the cheat sheet. This is actually from 31. I did like, a lot of people didn't like 31. I like 31, but that is an awesome photo of Richard Brake and a nice autograph of him right there. It's a bigger photo, so that's actually really cool as well. Again, I'm gonna show you all the variants after I get through the final item in the box and it looks like we have the Lords of Salem. So that's actually a really nice print. I really like this one. This print looks really badass for the Lords of Salem. So take a look at that. A nice photo of the Lords of Salem. Or print of the Lords of Salem. So that is all in our box. I have one photo going down. Let's take a look at the cheat sheet, but let me know in the comments section what your favorite item was let's take a look so first let's i almost i don't know what dropped but let's take a look at our richard brake so all of the photos of richard brake are actually pretty cool i do like all of them if i had a favorite if i had to choose which one i could get i'd probably go with this one right here but i do enjoy the one i got pretty nice all of them are pretty cool Let's take a look at the Munsters. So the one I got was the common or the variant. The rare one is actually Eddie Munster with his wife. Or Herman Munster. Sorry, not Eddie Munster. I don't, I don't, Eddie is on my mind. Herman Munster. I don't know why I just said Eddie. But anyway, Herman Munster. Jesus. So that's actually pretty cool. I... I don't have a favorite of these two. I don't mind either, even though this is a rare one. I like the one I got, so not too bad. Now let's go to our Ginger Lynn autograph. So of course, I got the one right here where she pulls out the gun on Captain Spaulding. There's another one where she pulls out the gun on Captain Spaulding. Honestly, I would have preferred the Devil's Rejects one, the poster right in the middle. That would have been really cool to get. Then we actually just have a Lords of Sound. Doesn't look like there is any Variants of that just the Lords of Salem and then finally we have our t-shirts So actually I would have liked that right that red one looks really cool that rare variant But both are really cool. I probably would have preferred the red But let me know in the comments section what your favorite item from this box was I'm gonna tell you mine As soon as I'm able to pick them up because everything was falling I'm actually gonna go with for this box. I'm gonna go with or Halloween t-shirt. Halloween is just one of my favorite horror franchises. I absolutely love it. So that's going to be mine. Let me know in the comments section what your favorite was. Hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you have a great rest of your day. And until next time, stay spooky. Peace.